Hi, this is just a quick video to talk about the um, resistance of a gold um, screen printer electrode. I wish I had one of our gold 303 electrodes um, with me. Unfortunately, I've just got one of the gold 203 electrodes. The reason I like the gold 303 electrodes is because we make it in quite high volume. And when you make something in high volume, you can give people the benefits of the um, volume. The fact that we're making it in high volumes mean that we can give people the benefits of um, high quality and a good price. Um, but I'm going to use the two, instead, I've only got the two or three with me, so I'm going to measure that, but it's, they're very similar, so I'll just measure it. And the reason I'm doing this is that the resistance of this um, from the contact point onto the electrode itself is um, about 1.2 ohms. The reason it's important is because people like to use these gold electrodes um, for sort forming things like self assemble monolayers where they can put proteins and DNA on there. Um, and they like to measure it by impedance spectroscopy sometimes. And they think, oh, well, maybe my electrode's going to be a problem. The fact is, these electrodes have you know, a one ohm resistance, so they're really going to form no part of your biochemical signal because the resistance is so low. So, in summary, um, when people are making um, biosensors and gold electrodes, I recommend the 303. Um, and if you're going to do it by impedance spectroscopy, then I've just done um, a quick measurement, and the resistance is sort of 1.1 ohms, 1.2 ohms, which is really sort of nothing. Okay, thanks very much.